Okay, let's see how this works. There we go. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Okay. That doesn't really matter. That also doesn't work. Hey, Muzz. How's going, Muzz? Watch, watch the, uh, the the timers, right? And now, e. pretty nifty, yeah. Very nifty. <laughs> you know an interesting thing about the word nifty? I, uh, I don't know that I've ever heard anything that could be described as the niftiest. Because I feel like nifty is... Oops. Nifty is, like, inherently a kind of underwhelming thing, right? Like, it's a, a small, nice thing. Yes, Lucas, that's exactly what I'm doing. Completely deliberate. Nifty is the niftiest nifty thing. It kinda is. It fills a niche so perfectly, like we needed a word for that. And nifty stepped up to the plate. But like, did we really need a word for that or did we just kind of want a word for that? Doesn't matter, nifty's here now. Right. Oh my god, hit him. Oh my god. There we go. Oh my god. Hey, Luce. Okay, guys, watch. Oh my god, what is wrong with me? Oh, I also wanted to check while I'm over here. Stop focusing that way. That's right. Okay. Okay. I, um... I wasn't sure when I was watching Lucas play the other day where his missed nitro boxes were, but I think I, I know now. So watch the timers! Oh, it stopped! Needed for things that aren't amazing, but also aren't moderate. Not quite good or great, yeah. 
Oh, that wasn't that bad at all, Deuce. Because, I mean, like, like any speedrun... I mean, any 120-type run, you can confirm that the person did the thing by seeing that they triggered the loot cutscene. And other than that, it's not that bad to uh, recognize that you clearly had the cheat code in. Or not the cheat code, but, you know, the, the hack or whatever you want to call it. And it's not like there was anything else that was special that needed to happen. I also found it funny, oops, uh, that we both died trying to get to Sunny Flight. I did that too in my run. Run. I specifically paid attention to see if you did that, and uh, I, I wish someone else would. It's a little tough to get it. I've failed it a number of times trying it in the few sparksless runs I did. Yeah, I mean, the zombie is really just a helper thing. It's not remotely needed. If it just goes well, then it doesn't really matter. Basically the only good level. Love it. I wish I could do that again. But my PS1 that I could do Game Sharks with stopped reading discs. So I need to get another one at some point. I see you throwing bottles, and I'd appreciate it if you'd stop with that. You could just get those bottles out of here. That'd be real swell. Dennis, get him! That's a very good nerf impression, Sarah. Oh, fuck. There we go. Oh, so close. Kinda nutty from what you saw out of it. Is it? Nutty how? Like, I know... Oh, wait. That's my split. I know... Lego Batman gets kinda wild. Um, just from watching Craig's runs. But I, I don't, I'm not really familiar with any other Lego games. Having a category in the later board that uses a cheat or hack. I'm so happy we do. <laughs> like, in my opinion, that's exactly the kind of craft that category extension should be used for. <laughs> Especially for Sparksless. Because, like, if Sparksless required you to take damage, that would be such a crappy run to have to do. Go to the menu, just launch straight in the air in a slope. Wow. Hey, so fun fact, I don't remember where all the tokens are. <laughs> I watched Lucas do this yesterday, and I was not paying attention. I remember a few of them. But that's it. Let's see, is there one around this flagpole? I think there might be. Because this is a jump. Let's see if I can get the jump. 
Oh, first try. That's honestly a really hard jump. Never mind, I remember where all the tokens are then. I, I really want to do Spyro 2 and 3 Sparksless. I would love to be the one lunatic who does a Sparksless 337. <laughs> dream come true for me. Oh, that might not get this. No, we're good. Oh, missed that though. Yeah, I don't know about that. I guess you would just be on one hit, would have to be the rule. A Sparks plus Jersey Devil run? I have not. <laughs> Bubsy Devil 3D, hell yeah. What's up, Bander? to reset the runs? No. God, like one of those Dark Souls runners. Watch the timer. Keep an eye on it. Keep an eye on that beautiful timer. And there it goes. I love it. It's so good. It does work. Kind of. We're not removing the loads. We're not removing all of the loads that we were manually removing before. I wrote this today, basically. This is like a prototype of a load remover. It's not getting all of them that we were manually removing. Oops. Uh, shit, I need to just... Yeah, okay. Uh, there's a live split component that people made that you can install um, that does part of it, and then there's also an OBS component you need to install to work with it. And basically it looks at the game feed. Uh, hello. It looks at the game feed and you give it certain images to compare to on certain parts of the screen. To recognize, like, hey, am I, in a, am I in a load screen right now? And if it is, then it'll... Like, if it has some amount of confidence that it's looking at a load screen based on what you fed it... Uh, it would be harder in Spyro. Jersey Devil has really clear load screens. Spyro, not as much. It would be nice in Spyro, though, but also... There's a bunch of other stuff you'd have to do. Oh, I forgot to get that one. Uh, there are some auto-splitters that work that way. Most auto-splitters work by reading game memory. But any auto-splitter that's working on console is, uh, is doing it visually, I think. I don't know of any other ways to do it. And yeah, dragon loads would be, like, impossible. <laughs> Guys, should I do a trick that I don't know how to do? <laughs> A trick that I, like, started looking into before I stopped running the game. You're gonna have to answer fast, because I'm about to get to it. I don't think... yeah, there's nothing there. Yes! Everyone says yes. Okay, I'll do it. Uh, there's the Okay, let's see if I can do this. That's not quite. Oh, fuck. That's really not quite. Really? I'm getting stuck there? Okay, this is wrong. Why am I getting stuck on the door frame? That's not normal. I should be able to do it from here. That's so weird. I don't remember getting stuck on that door frame. Basically, you can jump over that door. That's that's all it is. It's just kind of precise because those boxes break when you touch them. Oh well, that's a shame. I'm bad at this game. I should retire. <laughs> Ooh, 
one time I was trying to do that and I got it to warp me way up in the air and I don't know how that happened. And I wish I did. Because if we could skip that K door over there, that would actually be really big. Like, really, really big. Oh, there it is. And it's the end, not the R. I've thought about it, Luce. I haven't been able to come up with any that would be fun. But yeah, if you if you think of any, that that'd be cool. Yeah, I agree. How long is all tokens? Uh, a little under two hours. Under 150 if you're good, which I was, but now I'm out of practice. Split bone dance in these splits. I forgot about that. Oh, by the way, Lucas, if you didn't figure it out when you were fighting it, the trick to this boss is sometimes it like leans down, and that's when it's vulnerable. Come on. And as far as I can tell, it's RNG whether or not it does it. It is yet another RNG boss. Luckily, it does it pretty often, and it's only five hits. Nope. Okay. G-Boss and Jersey Devil? Can you believe it? What is this? Uh-oh. Well, the auto-splitter broke. <laughs> or the load remover broke. It definitely just left that in. And it took that out. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. I don't remember the route here. Uh, at all. I think it's... Let's see, it'll be here... Hey, give me that. These tokens are weird. What did I make it focus on? The word loading on the load screen. I think I should wait for this, actually. something stupid, that would be good. Hey, FTC. Get up there. There we go. Hey, Pepsi. Oh, also, Lucas, if you were curious, the two tokens you were missing were here and by the Batcave's entrance. No, the secret areas do not count. The tokens refer to the big tokens that you get 
when you beat one of the main levels in the game. All tokens is basically the all levels category, as opposed to any percent. We don't call it all levels because the bonus levels are also levels, and we don't do those. But yeah, it's it's pretty much any percent, but without doing the skip that any percent that makes any percent five minutes long. Sleep right after this. Right after this run, yes. We'll see when I sleep. I'll sleep when I'm dead. Let's see if I remember this skip. Ooh, love that. Okay. Oh, wait! Oh, let's freaking go! First try! Ooh, another one! Guys, that skip I did to jump across the- oh wait, that second one was loose, never mind. <laughs> that, uh, that, um, um, skip I did with the water is not easy. Max <laughs> nuclear blast, oh boy. It's a very good copy pasta. you're not wrong. I feel like I'm forgetting a token. Where's... The A. No, the A is the one at the end. Where's the N? Because the N's not this way. Oh, I'm dumb. I'm dumb is where the N is. Oh, fair enough, Muzz. I totally forgot. See, this is what happens when I don't play this game. I forget things. That's why it's good I'm doing these ILs. The N is in the onion head. You gotta kill this guy. This has secretly been a bot this whole time. Wow. You think you know someone. Then they turn out to be a robot. 21st century man. There we go. Now I die. Ding. There you go. Holy shit. We can skip this whole area in PAL, and I wish we could do it in, uh, in NTSC too. I would love to find a skip here. In PAL, you can just jump over that gate. And just not have to do any of this. You Give too much HP to Onion Head. I agree. In here? <laughs> I think in manual load removes we also got rid of those Narf cutscenes. So I'm, I don't know. I might have to figure out something for those. See if the lights are the same or something. But those scenes are also consistent, so who knows? Oh, Batty pointed out a time save that I'm surprised we never noticed. We don't have to ride these boxes, we can just jump and glide over here. Which, if you end up on a more normal cycle than I just was, would be a several second time save. We normally have to wait on, uh, on one of those boxes. What? What are you talking about, Eliza? No, not an onion lady, just an onion person. Ever killed the guy without getting hit by the bombs? Yeah, actually. I used to be okay at that. Zando and Lady sitting in a tree. H O L D I N G H A N D S. That's all they did. Oh, I mean, Lady Julep. 
That's right. I did forget. I don't remember where the tokens for Root Canal are. That's fun. I'm sure I'll figure it out. Big Frog. I love this Big Frog. According to anime, that's true. That's what this easy. I did most of that boss while looking away. I love that boss. No, no, not like in Root Canal. I mean in the park outside to get to Root Canal. Yeah, this is Jersey Devil for the PS1. Uh, the load- Oh! It doesn't show the word loading when you load the main area. That's the problem. Okay. That's what's going on. Like, you'll see when I come here, it says the word loading at the bottom. It doesn't do that when you go back. I don't think this needs to be raised. I think- no, it does. I'm totally wrong. Never mind, ignore me. This one, though. Does not need to be raised, actually. Now I remember. Those and that. Um. Am I coming back to this game? Yes. Yeah, I, I really am. I should really keep, uh, keep, um, um, practicing Mario Galaxy as well. But, yes, I absolutely am coming back to this. I know, I'm, <laughs> I might be a little bit tired. I don't know why I'm doing this right now of all times to be doing this. I'm, yeah, I'm definitely forgetting a token somewhere. Because there's the one here, and there's the, the F on the way there. I don't know where the R is. The R... this way? Is it over? Yeah, okay, it's right here. Weird. Uh, this is a special layout that I made in, like, five seconds. Because these splits are bigger than I normally have them. Oh, my number pad? My keyboard has a number pad. I'm splitting with it because it's great. This is a fun boss. Uh, it takes seven hits, but you can't actually start hurting it until you get rid of all its binds, so that's actually the first hit. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Let's see if I remember both of the two skips here. That's the easy one to remember. Where's the other one? Is it over here? Yes, it totally is. And one nice thing about these skips is they work in 100% too. You don't miss any of the nitro boxes by doing them. game? I don't think so. It wasn't very popular. 
for sure. I think I've seen it around for like less than ten dollars, which is heartbreaking because it is pretty dang good. What? Oh my god, is it? I must be thinking of something else. Then. <laughs> I would trust Lucas's... Lucas's, uh... Judgment on price. More than mine, he would know. Okay, so what are we gonna do about that that other loading screen? Come on, man. Come on, man. Eat this boss. Another RNG boss, by the way. It's random whether or not you can hit him. I guess the, um, the, like, loading card itself is gonna be the same, so we could check for, like, you know, any point in that image and look that way. That would be one option. How long is any percent? Uh, less than five minutes is world record. Once you know what you're doing, uh, you'll consistently sub 10. Basically, oh shit. So, intended, uh, there's a way to get to the last area of the game, but from there, oh shit, I missed again. From there, you're not supposed to be able to get to the final boss yet. There's a bridge that you need to raise. But, there's a really precise jump you can do to jump over the bridge. So, you can just go straight to the end of the game. What I'm doing right now is effectively any percent but without that skip. We call it all tokens. Uh, because you get a big token for every level you finish. Wait a minute, I don't need to be doing this. Oh my god, I totally forgot. I have a skip. I found a skip in my last big push on this category. Sorry, there are the five NARF tokens you're supposed to be collecting here to open a gate. But, uh, we don't need those. Let's say, yeah, it's gonna be over here. Just jump up here, skip the gate, and then you're supposed to do something to open this, but we don't need to do that either. We can just, just, we can just, we can just, uh, there we go. We can just clip through there. Sub 30? No. I wonder, is it possible to cancel a prediction? Or do you have to resolve it? Actually, I want to be over here, I think, and go like straight from here. Yeah! Let's go. Well, no, I mean, like, from a mod perspective. Like, when the mod finishes a prediction, can they say, no, this just didn't happen? Undo it. Or do they have to pick a side? So, the... NARF tokens that I'm collecting, like, I have the, the K right now, 
those open doors, but if you can skip any of those doors, then you don't need them. Oops. Is that a crash one box noise? Let's listen. Uh, no, not really. It's, it's slightly different than the crash noise. Yeah, I kind of want this golden pumpkin, actually. Even more than I want that life. Oh, that was a mistake. I shouldn't have gone. Ugh. These skulls bounce randomly. If you watch, they can even end up bouncing backwards and going back up the hill. Sometimes. Have a good night, Lucas. Congrats on big Ape Escape PBs. Everybody give Lucas a big congratulations for Ape Escape PBs. Two. Three. Four. I forget how many hits this guy takes. Oh, there's seven or ten, I think. Five. Six. Seven. I guess it's ten. Eight. Muzz, come on. Nine. Oh yeah, I guess he kind of does. Oh, I thought I would hit that, so I looked away. <laughs> Ten. Cool. Love it. And that's my teller done. How many hits does Dennis take? You fight Dennis several times. The first museum boss. I think it's... Is it five, then four, then three? It might be. Uh, I want to go in here. And normally, I would death abuse, but we started doing something different with the K, so instead I want to come right back out and go here? No, that's not right. No, this is right. Yeah, and then I jump down. Yeah, that's right. And then I gotta wait, because I was slow and dumb. I know when he pulls out his cane or stick or whatever it is, it's four hits on that phase, then three hits on the next phase, but I forget how many hits the first phase takes. Land. I want to say it's here? No, that's not quite right. Gotta be here then. Muzz, you gotta, you didn't congratulate Lucas for, uh, for getting two PBs in Ape Escape today. Also, I did see your message about mods needing to pick a side, and I'm disappointed in Twitch over that. Like, that feels like something that should be... They should be smarter about, I don't know. Maybe they have a good reason for it. I can see the advantage to requiring people to resolve things, but... Here's the best boss. It's the basketball boss. Uh, Obert. I know, Sarah. I had a feeling you would be excited about this. Usually if you can hit him backwards, you can get the ball to go straight to you. <laughs> yeah, 
Isn't that the best boss? I love that guy. Oh, uh, that was... That was higher up than I thought it was. I went just a little bit too far down. Uh, so it's here. There we go. That is a fun fact, Sarah. I don't know, I'm not that big a fan of that boss. It feels a little lazy to me. Although it does line up with the kind of old cartoon humor that this game goes for a lot. not the right angle. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, okay. This game's soundtrack is really good. It's maybe my favorite part of this game. No, it's definitely my favorite part of this game. <laughs> Easily. You know what, let's go for... No, let's not go for that, actually. I don't remember where, uh... I don't remember where to go for that. There, there's like a, a nook in that uh, that wall you can land on, but I don't remember where it is exactly, so I'm not going to try for it right now. In relation to my favorite part of this game, uh, yeah, no, it's still the music. Obert's a solid number two, but I really like the music. Damn it. so high that he deloaded. <laughs> That's actually kind of amazing. So I want to say it's this one, this one, this one, and this one. Hello. There we go. Me boxing match a spider. All I need to do is play this game one time, and I boxing match like ten spiders. You'll never catch me. <laughs> like a cheater. Hey. Muhammad Ali was famous for using his tail in boxing matches. Hey, Alexa. That was like his signature move. Remember in Rocky 2, when Rocky was punching some meat, and then he was like, Oh, I gotta use my tail. And then he started hitting the meat with his tail. It's a classic boxer move. <laughs> Shoot, that's a good point. I think you're right. Oh, what? No! Oh god, no! I can't save this. I can't save this. Ah, <sighs> where's the last checkpoint? Oh, that's not too bad, actually. Hey, 
Hey, are you guys ready for the worst RNG in the game? Because this boss actually has it. <laughs> like, this boss puts final nerf fight to shame. Big bat. Dennis is riding this bat. He can throw bombs at us. That was good. We want him... Okay, well, that wasn't good. Well, no, we still have a bomb. We want him... Okay, yeah, that wasn't good. We want him to throw bombs light enough that they land on the ground. Sometimes he can also throw them over our heads. Uh, also, sometimes he'll dive at us. See, like, that time he'll throw it past us and we can't use it. Um, but yeah, sometimes he'll throw a bomb to us and we'll pick it up and throw it and then he'll dive at us like he did the first couple of hits. And we need to hit him ten times. So yeah, this is worst RNG. I don't actually know what the odds are of any of his actions, I've never really looked into it, but, uh, seriously? And then is this gonna... okay, I still got a hit on him. The bombs also blow up if you wait too long, so if you're just holding one like a chump like I was, there's a decent chance it'll just blow up in your hands and hurt you anyway. Anyway. Narf RNG is annoying, but at least he throws a bottle every second and a half, so like, it, it's coming at you. Dennis takes a while, and if he decides to dive, then it takes that much longer to get past him. Two more hits, I think. Just helping out his boss, now we're here, I know. Oh yeah, also sometimes he just leaves without doing anything. Like that. Come on, D-Man. Come on, D-Dog. Come on, Dennis the Menace. Okay, one more hit, one more hit. This was... Oh, fucking hell. This has been pretty mediocre, Dennis RNG. Or I guess I should call it bad RNG since you fight Dennis a bunch of times, but... So yeah, that was... a little over two minutes. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do one more level and then call it for the night, I think. Because I don't I don't want to go through the whole round. I mostly just wanted to get footage using the load remover to show that it worked. <laughs> I also don't really want to do toxic waste. That's a very long level. Oh, no, I missed it. No. Hey, fun fact, by the way, you can skip into this bonus. You can just glide into that uh, and clip right in. It's the only bonus you can skip into. Oh, wait, that was that, actually. It's a very short split, but I, I keep time for it. I missed it. 
There it is. No, wait. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I don't fucking know anything. It's been a long time. <laughs> Amazing. Also, I'm doing great on live, so hopefully the skips work out. <laughs> safe. A little bit safe. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, let's go. This is not the fastest route. I just forgot the fastest route. So I'm doing this instead. FPC, let's go. You! How did you get in here? Uh, if you do that, it just doesn't count, basically. It, uh, it just deletes the extra token that you got, and you can't, uh, you can't use it. I think I'm supposed to split going in that window, actually. I don't remember. God, it's been so long since I've done this. I'm not gonna save whatever splits I get from this run. I, I don't trust my, uh... Surprise! I don't trust my... my <laughs> splitting method. You. Why can't we be friends? Join me, and I'll give you anything you want. Look for me. <laughs> Oh, that's right. Am I supposed to be hitting her at the start? I don't remember. I think I am. I think I might have missed a phase on her because of that. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I just, I'm not crazy about this one. choice, Muzz. Uh, I think that's it, actually. Yeah. I agree, Sarah. Here's the thing about Ober, you can see him make some sick shots. Also, he's a zombie. Those are just some fun facts about Ober. <laughs> Granted, we haven't seen Devil Lady play basketball, but I think the fact that she's not playing basketball says a lot.
Anyway, I'm gonna call it there. Her job by tells you she could dunk? That's true. That's that's a fair point. No, I'm not going to update my best times. Anyway. Jersey the Devil's a fun game though. I'm gonna see if there's anyone come on Twitch. Anyone that I want to raid? Um, not terribly. I guess I'll raid Skylighter, who is doing a very crazy N++ speed run. He's getting all of the challenges in B-Row and N++, for the people here who are familiar with N++ and knows what that means. Thanks for watching, everybody. Have a good night.